What's up Bruin peeps, it's Bruin Daddy here. And this is a video I've been wanting to do for quite a while. I've had this product for a little while now. This is my Brita Ultramax water filter. I've had it for maybe six, seven months now. And this is what I use to filter all my water that I use for my brewing. Uh, since I started using this, I've gotten a lot better results from uh, my final product of uh, brewing. And I think it's worth investing in, especially if you're buying bottled spring water. Uh, you're gonna save a lot of money in the long run and you just come out with a lot better product. Um, this filters all the impurities out and the water itself tastes great. I have drank the water by itself and uh, you can tell a huge difference uh, from tap water. So a couple things, this is a roughly, I wanna say about two quarts uh, so you're going to fill this container, it has a little lid that flaps up so you can fill it. I'll show you that real quick. So you just pop that up, fill it, fill it to the top here. And uh, just going to take it apart so you can see all the components. That's your filter, they're replaceable. Uh, you can get these off of eBay or Amazon, they're not very expensive, maybe 20 bucks for six of them. That's where I got my last few. I think I'm on my fourth filter, I believe, right now. But that's what the uh, container looks like that it goes down in. So it fits down in those little slots, line it up just like that. So when you pour the water in here, it filters to the filter and it comes out the bottom here. You don't want to fill this up any more than one of these to the top because your filter will be just submerged and sitting in the water. So it works best with just one of these containers and it's roughly about two quarts. And of course you got a spout, which is a really nice spout, it works great. So how I use this, I used to buy gallon spring water for brewing. And when I decided to purchase this, I paid about $45. I got this from, I believe I got it from Lowe's because I was having a hard time finding it at other places but you can get this on Amazon I think it was a little bit more on Amazon I don't know why but Lowe's and Home Depot Walmart probably has them but you have to order them and have it shipped I went and picked this one up at Lowe's it was in stock but uh the way I use it I'll elevate it up about yay high about taller than a milk jug or a water jug and I'll fill it and as it's filtering, I'll open the spout and I'll have it going directly into my water jug. And I'll keep doing that until I fill, you know, however many jugs I need. I, I try to keep about five of them on hand in case I decide I'm going to do a five gallon batch. But this thing works great. I have used it. Gosh, I've probably filtered, I don't know how many gallons of water, probably 40 or 50 gallons minimum. But I can tell a huge difference. As soon as I started using this, my beers, they taste so much better. Uh, they seem to ferment better. They just seem to, you know, tap water has a lot of chemicals in it that's going to affect your yeast. So using this is going to help you a lot. But wanted to show you all this. I talk about it all the time that I filter my water in the bread. I want to show you what I'm actually using. There's other options. They have uh, pitchers. I think for brewing, this is the best option because it's a more voluminous container and it, it processes a lot more, it seems. Uh, than a pitcher would. But anyways, I'm gonna put a link. I'll, I'll try to find some suppliers. I know Lowe's has them. I'll put a link to Lowe's product listing on their website and Amazon if I can find some links there. I'll link it in the description. But don't forget to check out brewingdaddy.com. Check out our sponsor, More Beer. We'll have a link in our description for that. And uh, also check out all our social media, Facebook, uh, Twitter. Uh, we have Instagram as well. Peace out, people. We'll see you next time.